Hello there. Hey, this is Paul Hansen, and welcome back to my Paul Hansen music tutorial series. This is uh, dealing with technique, musicality, uh, theory, all kinds of different things, bassoon and saxophone, music related. Well, today I'm going to feature a concept people ask me a lot about, which is my Hockett delay uh, technique. Now, Hockett, Hockett delay basically is uh, a single line played on a musical instrument with a delay attached to it that makes it sound like a, I guess, two instruments playing or a play, an instrument playing much faster than it really is. So, uh, there's a lot of videos of me doing this on YouTube, so I thought I'd explain this. So, here we go uh, for the use of this video, the tempo of this is going to be 116 for the quarter note. So you'll see some music here. It takes a little bit of getting used to. Sometimes you want to work with the metronome first to, if you have set it up correctly in your delay unit. Uh, for this particular delay, it's set at uh, 365 milliseconds, I believe. Uh, I'll show a screenshot here that explains that. And it's a little misleading in this picture because it says uh, dotted quarter note delay, it's really a dotted eighth note delay. So when I play a note on the first sixteenth note of the bar, say this, it comes out on the fourth one over here. So one, two, three, four. It comes out on, the, uh, on a dotted eighth note. So, uh, so it's the last sixteenth uh, note of the measure that the repeat's going to come back. So you play a note, dot, n -n dot, like that. Um, so here we go. Uh, again, eighth note. Sorry, I was a little slow at the beginning, so this is the tempo. And here's with the pedal. So, everybody knows Hannon exercises. Uh, most people do uh, piano players, uh, horn players, violinists. They're great scale exercises. This is how they sound. You'll hear this, you probably recognize this. two measures are on your screen. So forth. Again, the first two measures are only going to concentrate on this now for the exercise. So, here is uh, some things you can do with that. Here is a well, thank you very much. Hope you have uh, enjoyed that and uh, come back again and visit my channel. And uh, there's links to my website where you can also uh, get information about Skype lessons. And uh, look forward to seeing you guys. I do teach on Skype. It's very fun, and, uh, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.